get it from Clarence Center to Center Stage. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Taylor Epps catches up with one of the Rockettes. <laughs> It's a Christmas tradition. Just the most spectacular thing that's really getting everyone in the Christmas spirit. For more than 90 years, the Radio City Rockettes have been hitting center stage, dazzling crowds, and kicking off the holiday season. Radio City stage is like no other. A stage that dancers all over the world dream of. For Western New York native Sultana Shavi, it's now a reality. I had many dreams. Being a Rockette was always one of them. I actually saw the Rockettes in Buffalo for the first time when they were on tour. Just the beauty and elegance that they had, I really thought that that would be the perfect combination of all of my training, and that was the dream. She grew up in Clarence Center, then trained at the David DeMarie Dance Studio and the American Academy of Ballet and Dance. Very sweet personality and um, very focused. My husband used to always say because of her long legs that she should be a Rockette. <laughs> It's come full circle that she's done the Nutcracker since she was two years old, and now she's performing Christmas Nutcrackers every day. It might look glamorous, but it's not easy. We rehearse for about six weeks, six hours a day, six days a week, so it's an extremely rigorous process. So I try to get here about two and a half, maybe three hours before the show to do all my hair and makeup because each Rockette does their own hair and makeup. So I'll go upstairs and do some weight training sometimes and really get my body ready to do a show or two or three or four. The support from her family is what helps her through. They've been amazing. My family came the first week of shows. My mom saw the show three times within that period. I know it by heart. Mm -hmm. I can dance it with them. But don't worry, there's still time for you to get tickets. I would love to have more people from Buffalo come to the audience. It's a short flight over. We run through January 5th. Even after the holiday season comes to an end, the spirit doesn't have to. Taylor Epps, 7 Eyewitness News.